Hi, I'm Neil deGrasse Tyson, your personal astrophysicist and host of Cosmos, a space-time odyssey. Together with writer, executive producer, Andrewian, executive producer, Seth McFarlane, and executive producer, director, Bronan Braga, we're excited to bring the new Cosmos series to Fox and the National Geographic Channel in 2014. Meanwhile, today, I'm here to share with you a special Geek Week presentation, 10 Reasons to Love Science. And in this playlist, we offer stirring clips from Carl Sagan about science and humanity, some amazing anamorphic illusions, and a robot cheetah that can run faster than Usain Bolt. Maybe the playlist will inspire you to pursue your own curiosities. The question is, if you get a cloth dripping wet without gravity and you wring it out, what's going to happen? Macropin is a small, dark fish with large fins, a tiny mouth, and a remarkable pair of eyes. The two green spheres in these video shots are the lenses of its tubular eyes. As this piece of charcoal comes down and hits the surface, it actually bounces up again. It actually starts burning when it's in the air. It will not be we who reach Alpha Centauri and the other nearby stars. It will be a species very like us, but with more of our strengths and fewer of our weaknesses. More confident, far-seeing, capable, and prudent. quantum locking, the, the superconductor is locked in space and it stays wherever I put it. I just levitate it above the track quite high and I can just rotate it upside down and then it is suspended. Life on Earth during more than three and a half billion years of existence has been persistently assaulted by natural sources of mayhem, death, and destruction. Ecological devastation exacted by volcanoes, climate change, earthquakes, tsunamis, storms, and especially killer asteroids have left extinct 99.9% .9 of all species that have ever lived here. That's it. Click the link in the description to see the full playlist and stay tuned to YouTube for more of the best of Geek Week 2013. And of course, don't forget to tune in to Cosmos next year. It will be a space-time journey you will never forget. To learn more about science, turn off your electronic device, go outside and look around a bit. Nature is calling you. Go on, the internet will still be here.